At this time of year, I wanted to take a, just a little bit of time to say thank you. We started school 100 days ago. I need to clarify, I know it's not 100 school days ago. My lower grade elementary teachers celebrate that day. I know we're not there yet. However, this year, I would beg to say that those 100 days probably feel like 100 school days. Because if you're like me, most of those days you've been working on school. You've been adjusting some lessons, working with technology, answering emails, questioning your sanity, cursing COVID, eating more chocolate, and drinking more caffeine than you probably should. But through it all, we've provided consistency. We've supported each other. We've supported our students and their families. We have stepped up to fill in during quarantines, been responsible and stayed home when we were sick, taught online students and students in the classroom, taken temperatures, cooked, served, packaged, and delivered thousands of meals, counseled students and parents. We've become Zoom experts, uploaded gigabytes of information to Canvas, and even administered some testing on short notice at the request of some crazy administrators and board. Speaking of that data, our RISE scores are looking pretty good, better than expected, and our Cadence reading scores look amazing. We know and we've known that what you are doing is working and the students are still learning and progressing because of your efforts in this unique time. And now we have a little bit of data that proves it as well. So thank you for your support, for being there for each other, for showing up each day when healthy and for making Lincoln great. I often get asked what makes our school great. People in the community know that what we are doing here and we have a reputation. I always tell them that it's the people this year You've been even greater than ever before. I hope that you have a safe, happy Thanksgiving. Take some time for yourself, eat some extra pie, and forget about school for a day or two. Thank you for braving new norms together at Lincoln.